guys welcome back to my channel i bought a lot of things from disney but don't worry because this is stuff within like a span of a year so this is a very very big actually not that big i used to go like spending crazy at disneyland but i think i've toned it down a little bit thank god um but yeah so i been to disneyland for a well from when i left okay within a span of a year i went to disney world for my college program that ended in september 2022 and then october 2022 we went to disneyland and i met up with my friends from my disney college program they flew over from florida and we met in california so we went to disneyland in october february 2023 my family and I went to Disneyland. We went to California and um, we went during Valentine's Day, so that was really fun. May, I didn't go to Disneyland, but I did go to Disney Aulani Resort, which I do have a vlog about, so um, you can go watch that if you want to. So we did that, I'm pretty sure in May. We went in September 2023 for Ethan and I's anniversary, so <sighs> yeah. It was a lot of Disney within a span of a year and it was a lot of fun, very expensive, but I'm excited to show you guys all the things that I got from my recent trips. But we have like three bags of stuff and I'm very, very excited. Okay, so first thing, so this isn't everything that I bought, mostly because some stuff is just put away or they're hung up or like in my kitchen and stuff. First thing, okay, so we went in October, like a week right before Halloween. So sadly, we did not go to Oogie Boogie Bash. We didn't think that far ahead of like our trip, so we didn't get the tickets for that. But um, we were there during Halloween time, so I got, this is a zipper, but it's so cute because it looks like the, it's the Mickey pumpkin, like when you walk into Disneyland. So, um, it's also like a snow globe. I did have Sprite in here and I don't think I ever washed it out. But, it's really cute. It sits on my shelf. Also on that trip, I did get this keychain and it came with a little straw. Boy Story is my favorite Pixar movie. So, he's dressed as Buzz Lightyear and he's holding a little... Jack Lantern? No. Trick or Treat Bucket. Um, so yeah. I love keychains. I collect keychains and I put them on my bags or I just put them all on like one keychain together. So this is the free lanyard that I got because when you book like when you book a trip through Disney, you get a free lanyard and a free pin. So my free pin was this one. It's Mickey and Minnie and it says Disneyland and then I bought a mystery pack with cakes. So this is one of the cake pins that I got. This one is Rapunzel. And then this one is Jasmine. And I did some trading. So this one I traded with my friend Ellie. She gave me that one. And then I traded for this 2021 Disneyland. Cause I don't think I was, the, I don't think I went to Disneyland in 2021. Yeah, I didn't. So now I have the 2021 pin. I always collect a year pin for when I go. It was just something that, um, it was like a tradition that my dad started for me. I also got like this little fluffy bag thing. I use it. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be an AirPods holder. That's how they advertise it. But I use it to hold my trading pins. And I don't have any in there. Around that time is when Munchling started to become a thing. So... I got Baymax. He's so cute. I think this is the cutest munchlings that they have. And this one's scented. He stays on my desk and he is displayed. All right, next. Next area is when I went during Valentine's Day. So this is the Valentine's ears that they had of the year. I thought it was so beautiful. It kind of looks like my bubble bar ears that I have, but it has like the flowers and it's just super girly and I don't really have ones like this that are this color and is like sparkly. So I have these ears and they're very gorgeous. Also around this time, I did get the viral fur jackets, but it's in my closet. So 
I'm not gonna take that out. Also, I'm not gonna try it on because it's so hot right now. Um, but I got a lot of compliments on that. So that is gonna be the go-to outfit if I go to Florida during winter time. I don't think I'm ever gonna go back during summer because um, that was terrible. I did get this tote bag because it was so cute. I'll probably take it to the beach, but it's a really, really thick canvas tote bag. So this is the tote bag that I got. I got it from Disneyland. It says Mickey and Friends, but I really like um, the colors. It was really pretty. And I really, the flowers on the bottom is embroidered. So it's really stands out, but yeah, I'm gonna probably take this to the beach. It's a huge bag. Oh, oh, okay. Now I remember what I bought in October. I shoved it in my closet. <laughs> I don't know how I forgot about this. Um, I got the Disneyland Starbucks tote bag. So I have the Disney World one, and when I saw that one, I had to get the Disneyland one. So I got the Disneyland one in October. I saw that they just released like a new set of them for this year, and I haven't decided if I liked it or not yet. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna get it if I see it, but I now have the Disneyland tote and this was my favorite bag. Still is, but I don't really carry it around as much anymore, but I'll probably take this with me on my next trip to Disneyland just to like hold stuff that I buy. I didn't get that much stuff during this specific trip because um, when I'm, usually when I would go with Ethan, we only go for like a few days. Uh, when I was with my parents, we were there for like over a week, so I had to save my money for certain things. Like we went to Ikea, we went to like a lot of other places that I can't even remember because this trip was like a year ago. And I just found Belle. Um, Blue Dress Belle is my favorite Belle. So I really wanted to get her. I don't know if I'm gonna take her with me on my next trip though. Probably to a Disney World rather than Disneyland just because there's a Belle section. I got Mulan. My uh, one of my friends, she bought Alice, and she bought the little uh, Epcot cast member outfit. So that is what I'm gonna do for Mulan, since she kind of looks like me. I really don't think the Moana one looks like me, and the the Moana one, the hair is hideous. Okay, I don't know what they did to it, but um, it don't look like her. So I got Mulan. I did get this cup and I thought you could reuse it like how you do at Disney World but they don't let you do that. So um, it's fine though. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this but it is the Disney 100 cup and it has like a lanyard so I thought that was really cool so I really wanted to get it for some reason. You know what? I'll put my smoothies in here. I'm going to drink my smoothies in here. That is what I'm going to do with that. Shortly after that it was the Little Mermaid. And I had a whole Little Mermaid obsession. I did get the ears. It's currently in the box. Um, I got the ears, the lounge fly. I got pajamas. I got a bunch of school supplies. Literally everything that had the Little Mermaid on it, um, I bought it. So, best movie ever. I still watch it at least once a month now. So, um, but anyway, I got Max. And it's so cute. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna do with him though. I have to find like a bag for me to put it on. But shortly after that trip, they released some Disney 100 stuff on Shop Disney. So I did get the Disney 100 jacket. And I love that jacket. It keeps me warm. I keep it in the car though because I use it as my blanket. But I did wear it on my October trip. So I did get that online. I also got this hoodie online. I mean this jacket and it has Mickey in the front and in the back it's just like all of the characters. I also got this Starbucks cup. I'm not really like into expensive cups but I really really like this one because Disney California Adventure is my favorite park so I had to get this one and it's a really like nice bronze color um but it's literally just I know you can't really see it that well, but I love this cup. It's really pretty. 
All right, so I did get a couple other things. However, I have no idea where I put it. So I'll just put pictures on the screen of what it is. I got the Disney 100 ears and I also got the hoodie. So I don't know where I put it. I'm in the middle of cleaning my room, so that's why everything is kind of everywhere, but yeah, I have no idea where that went. Now I did go to Aulani and this is the refillable cup that I got. I got a blue one, I got my dad a green one, and then Ethan got like a different one with like the characters on it. So very classic. I think some of the stuff is just really touristy looking. So that's why I didn't get a lot of their things. But I did find this and I thought it was super cute. It is a bowl. I love kitchen stuff. So this one um, is a bowl that has a little shave ice on the inside. And then all around it, it has like little icons from um, like the food places at Olani. So there is the Ulu Cafe, Makahiki. That used to have be like the best buffet until they got rid of it from COVID. Um, and then we have Mama's Snack Stop, Little Opihis, the Olelo Room, uh, Wailana Pool Bar, and then Ama Ama. So yeah, it has all like these really cute little icons. Haven't used it yet because I wanted to feature it in the video. So now that I did, we can start using it. Last but not least, I did get a stuffed animal. Had to. Um, I got a Shelly Mae stuffed animal and I was debating if I wanted to get like the regular size one Where you can buy the different outfits for her or if you get if I wanted to get the small one So I got the smaller one and I believe She's wearing a Tori Richard dress. I do have the matching ears. So is it Tori Richard? Uh, I'm not sure but I do have the matching ears and it's so cute. I love Shelly um and I love bears, so I really wanted to get her to remember my first trip to Olani. Then in September, we went for Ethan and I's anniversary. Um, I did get only one pair of ears, which is really good for me because I would buy like four at a time every time I'd go on a trip. So I did get a classic pair. I've been eyeing these ones for kind of a while. I just, I don't know, I never bought it. I should have bought it when I had my cast member 50% off discount, but I didn't. So, I have her now. I'll probably take these with me onto my next trip because of like how classic it looks. <sighs> and it, it just goes good with every outfit. I got this Halloween backpack um, because I needed another bag for my carry-on. And they had this backpack and it wasn't like super out there. Um, so that's why I wanted it. It's really nice and big, so I think this is gonna be my new travel bag as my carry-on. Um, so in here, we got a lot of things. First things first, I got this cute little pouch. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with it. I'll probably use it as a pencil bag. I did get this magnet for Rogers the Musical. Sadly, we did not see Rogers the Musical because it ended like the day right before we got to Disneyland, but they were selling the merch at a discount. So I got Rogers a Musical Magnet. I did also get us matching shirts that I posted on Instagram. I got two prizes, okay? I've been playing, um, where'd it go? I've been playing the La Luna Star Catchers for years. Also the Heimlich Caterpillar throwing game. And I've never won the Caterpillar game but this is the first time that I actually ever won a big prize from the La Luna Star Catcher. I've only ever gotten the small prizes, which is fine because I love the, the small prizes. I give them to my dogs. Um, but this is the first time that I ever got the medium and the large prize. <laughs> I was so happy. Okay, but yeah, so I got those. They're gonna be displayed because I'm so happy about that. This is my hair clip because I'm a hair clip girl. It's my hair clip that I actually got from Hot Topic. I did not go to Oogie Boogie Bash. Wish I did, but this would have been literally been perfect if I did go. So I got that. 
and we did get a lot and a lot of like magnets and stuff so this i got a disney 100 magnet these are our three pin and lanyard set that we got for um looking through disney i got a little mermaid um magnet so yeah, if you see the trend here, we're starting to collect magnets of like our trips that we go on. Okay, so this one is says Limoncello Saluti um, Italy. And I thought it was funny that I found it at Disneyland because I worked in Italy Pavilion um, in Epcot. And for some reason they were selling this. Oh, it broke. Anyway, for some reason they were selling this at Disneyland. So I was like, that is hilarious. I also need to get a magnet of Italy for my house so yeah and then also a bunch of their merch says salute on it although i was told that it's salute like with the e at the end but not an i but I had to get it also because the lemon cello i got this cute little baby keychain from star wars i really wanted the pork but they i guess they're out so i need to go see if they have the pork but it's so cute. It reminds me of my dog. Now, this is all of the pins that I got. Um, I got Agatha. This pin is huge. But I got Agatha. She's my favorite. Um, I love WandaVision. So I had to get Agatha because I love the theme song. And I got like a bunch of these. Um, this is just a couple of them because I have no idea where the other ones went. But I got a bunch of these Disney princess um, pins because they're, it's them in their other outfits. So this is like Cinderella. We have Ariel in the pink dress, which is really pretty. I got Belle in the blue dress. And I also, I think I got Jasmine, which is in like the purple outfit, which is really pretty. I also had this thing about buying cups for souvenir cups and I got kind of a lot of them so I got this one I got it at flows and I really wanted the shake inside got this one from the hungry bear and I just got like I think I got blue powerade in here but it looks like a little mason jar so I might make juice and just drink it out of here and then I got a mint julep when we went to eat at blue bayou for our anniversary dinner and it came in like this tin cup which is really interesting but so yeah it says new orleans square so this one was a set and it came with cinnabon a cinnamon bun mickey baymax and then Minnie mouse so i did break the stitch one um it's over here these things are really fragile but it's a pineapple upside down cake of Stitch. And this is a My Adventure book. So we do have the one from Amazon, but I was like, I kind of want the real one. So this, this is the real one. We're gonna put our pictures of our trips and stuff in here. But I lo we love Up. Um, Doug is like our thing. So yeah. We're gonna put our pictures of our travels in here together and everything else. We got a popcorn bucket. I slowed down on my popcorn buckets. I was really into the Mickey balloon ones, but yeah, no, we slowed down on getting popcorn buckets. However, there was this one that we wanted to get back in October when we went in 2022 and we forgot to go back and get it. So we bought it on our most recent trip and it is mater so the top kind of goes down like this and i do have a lightning mcqueen one so now they're gonna be displayed together i don't know where in my room i'm gonna put that but it, it will go somewhere last few things i did not get these on my trips i bought them online on shop disney i got the star wars ears that are supposed to be kind of be like the designer ones but um, they actually are pretty good quality and I don't have any Star Wars ears. So that's why I got these ones and I also got the really cute 
snowman ones but I did cut off the um, I cut off the scarf so that I can make tiny little bows so that's really cute that is me literally going light because I used to be super obsessed with buying Disney stuff but I did slow down a little bit so yeah I'm going on two Disney trips later this year which I'm really excited for I'm gonna go for a Disney Channel night and um, probably during the summer and then that's probably it but yeah very excited for that thank you guys for watching the video hope you enjoyed i'll see you guys in the next one